Hey everybody, Mr. Bullock here, and this uh, geometry lesson is on the side-side-side postulate, SSS. Let's go ahead and start, you guys. Uh, all corresponding parts of congruent triangles are congruent. We use that statement a lot. All corresponding parts of congruent triangles are congruent. I just memorized it as CPCTC, which means corresponding parts of congruent triangles are congruent. Okay, we'll use that a lot. Not so much in this lesson, but in a couple of lessons from now, and then from now on we'll use it. So here's the side-side-side postulate. It deals with triangles. If three sides in one triangle are congruent to three sides in another triangle, then those triangles are congruent. And when the triangles are congruent, then by CPCTC, all the other corresponding angles are going to be congruent. All right, so decide whether these triangles are congruent by side-side-side. Okay. Okay, can you see that I have three sides on one triangle equal to three sides on another triangle? And if that's the case, then yes, they're congruent. How about this? Are all three sides on the top triangle equal to all three sides on the bottom triangle? Nope, because that one's four and that one's three. They all have to be equal, so that's a no right there. How about that one? Is the lefty congruent to the righty? Yeah, it looks like uh, all three sides are congruent, so that's a yes right there. How about that one? Okay, that one, you can say that by the reflexive property, that middle one, it equals itself. So for both triangles, that would be a big fat yes on that one. So that's a side, side, side also. Reflexive, uh, you use a lot, you guys. All right, so use the coordinates to determine if triangle ABC is congruent to triangle DEF. Okay, and all, so we're going to see if they're congruent by side, side, side. So here's ABC, DEF, all those ordered pairs. I'm going to use distance formula to figure out if the sides are equal lengths. Okay, so let's see if, uh, let's do for, from A to AB, we'll use the distance formula, and AB would be first and second letter, so first and second letter would be DE. So I'm going to use distance formula for AB and DE, and it turns out that both of those equal 5. So now I'm going to uh, try uh, another pair of congruent parts right here, BC and EF. And I found out those two aren't equal. I get 5 and 3. So right there, that tells me, no, they're not, they're not congruent to each other. Okay, so the triangles are not congruent right there. I can stop. I don't need to do any more. I just figured out. Uh, now, if they were, I'd go ahead and do the third pair of sides. But that one right there told me they weren't. So decide whether the congruent statement is true. Here's number one right there. Okay, now definitely these triangles are congruent by side, side, side. But are they in the appropriate orders? So here I went from PSI. So PSI. So I went from I went from one dash to three dashes. It has to be in the same order. Okay, so this says DRE. Okay, this one goes three dash to two dash. No, they're not in the same order. So this is not correct. This congruence statement is not correct. If I was going to say PSI to go from one to three, I would have to go from one to three, so this side to this side. So I'd have to say E D R. Okay. So no, they're not. Con it's not correct. P S I would be congruent to uh, E D R. Oops, I forgot my little triangle symbol there. But you guys get the uh, get the picture right there. All right. So how about this one here, you guys? Um, okay. So here, here I have um, T H O. So here's a uh, T H O. So I went from two dash to this diagonal that doesn't have a mark right here so is so m o h so m o two date yeah this one that looks correct okay it's not it's in the correct order right there okay all right so find the measure of the exterior angle this is from the last lesson remember the exterior angle equals the sum of the two remote interior angles so uh, find out that x equals 9 and then it says find that usually x is not the answer so plug in 9 right there 9 times 9 plus 9 is uh, 90 okay so that's a nice little right triangle right there okay do that with this one here okay that 8x is equal to 90 plus 2x so um, I get uh, x equals 15 so you should get 120 for that exterior angle okay nice and easy